life was a Mario Kart race. How do you start off your day? Uh, do you wake up with a hangover? Or, you know, think about Mario Kart, you either peel out right off the bat, you crash into the wall, you have a crappy start, but you can recover. I've won plenty of races, even when I was in last place. But, are you not better off to pay attention and speed up, get a head start, uh, you know, whatever that is. Someday it might be eating a piece of chocolate cake first thing in the morning. Why? Because I feel like it. Um, is that really the most suggested thing to do? Not all the time. If you do that every day, you're probably not gonna feel very good about lunchtime. But if you take a nap, you're fine. Um, maybe. But I do suggest, uh, you know, getting sleep, drinking enough water, Keeping yourself in it, listen to a song you like, eat a piece of cake, whatever you gotta do. But um, yeah, if you give yourself that advantage of getting a head start, having some sort of a plan with what you wanna do in the day and getting some of it done and live a little bit of a leeway where you don't have to get some of it done, it tends to make for a better race. Um, but that's my uh, thoughts on it. I do start the day off with a cup of coffee. I was just talking about uh, switching from creamer to cinnamon and milk and that does it for me for a long time though I couldn't I was stuck on the creamer I don't always drink coffee but I tend to go through probably a few months of drinking coffee and then a few months off the aroma always gets me back uh, I love the smell of a good coffee um, and good coffee is different to everyone I know some people are into espressos and double shots and all this stuff. Um, not me, not not so much. But I do try to try different types of coffee because, boy, it's amazing the different tastes you can get. Uh, I'll switch up my flavors once in a while. Out of curiosity, boredom. Sometimes I pick a crappy one, of course. That's gonna happen. It's like life. Sometimes you make a dumbass mistake and then. You gotta correct yourself, and if it is a race, then, you know, it's gonna happen. That's why getting a good head start gets you, you know, ahead, out of the gate, instead of trying to play catch-up. Some people like that better. I think some people, you know, it's just like being clutch, being a clutch player in sports or life. Uh, you know, uh, Carl Young says that life doesn't start until we're 40. Until then... We're just putting the pieces in play. So, if I look at it that way, I feel pretty good about myself. Was he making the quote just to make people feel better about themselves? I highly doubt it, considering his work. Although I can't say I'm that knowledge on his work. But from what I've read, it doesn't seem like that uh, is the type of person he is. Um, but I've noticed with myself, I can have a day... Where it doesn't start off good, maybe, you know, the cat wakes you up at 6 in the morning, and uh, guess what? That, that happened a few days in a row, so I got used to it, start falling asleep a little bit earlier, and then it doesn't bother me. Now, the cat wakes me up at 6, I let the cat out after I feed her, and then I can go back to sleep if I want for a little bit, or decide to pay homage to the sunrise and get a head start on the day. And neither one of those choices is wrong if you have the choice. And no one's going to penalize you for getting up late if you don't have to. Uh, worry about that. Or waking up early. But then that's going to affect the other end. Now, you might want to go to sleep early or take a nap because you've woke up at 6 in the morning and sometimes that makes for an awfully long day. Especially, as always happens, unexpected things get thrown into the play like a banana peel in Mario Kart, well, crash into a banana peel in Mario Kart and you spin out, look out for red turtle shells. Uh, I still haven't seen the new Mario movie, but I do plan on it. Uh, my son's quite enjoying Mario 3D World, uh, and once in a while Mario Kart. It was fun in the arcade. Uh, I don't play games that much anymore, but I like to watch them. Some of them have pretty good stuff going on. But that's getting off the topic, and so I will go ahead and end it, as I'm trying to keep these under five minutes, and I have failed, but that's okay. Because, like I said, give yourself a little leeway, and then 
failure is experience and not a failure. Thanks for watching. All right.